Well, boys, it's another day at Elevated AF here. Uh, Colton has been gone on vacation over the weekend here, but uh, he was in the shop early this morning. I told him to go pick up a new trailer for the Audi R8 and take it in for service here, so he should be getting back any minute with that. Although I'm not sure what truck he took to go uh, pick up that trailer with. Maybe he took his own. Not too sure there, but he should be getting back any second now. Anyways, the plan for today is to build a uh, little brother to the big 350 Dually to tow a camper. We need a matching uh, truck and camper for this. Although I don't think this time it's going to be red. Let's see how it goes. Uh, but what the heck? No, he... Colton! Yeah? So you read my text this morning and thought, hey, let me go Let me go pick up the new trailer with the, with the car. Well, yeah, why not? Just because it has a hitch on the back does not mean you should use it. Hey, it works. That's not the point. <laughs> did, did you at least get well, the car serviced? Of course. Oh, my. You, you saw all these trucks around here and you thought, yep. I'm going to take the Audi R8 in for service. This trailer is supposed to be to haul the Audi R8. Hey, man. Oh, my goodness. I don't know what to tell you. Trying to be like Alex Troy or something over here? Maybe, maybe. Oh, my goodness, dude. Okay. Well, uh, take this thing around back. I hope you didn't wreck anything on this. Oh, hey, no. She's free. mint. Okay. That's right. Back her in nice and easy. Don't scratch it. Okay, Colton, I need you to take the Sherp in for service because we don't know how to work on these things. Do not. I repeat. Do not take the flipping Audi to go tow this thing. I can't make any promises. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well, just, just grab a trailer from the back there. I Take the semi-trailer because I got to go uh, pick up the new 350 with the uh, the other trailer. All right, which trailer am I taking? I guess this one, but Colton's truck's on it. Col Colton? Yeah? I'm just going to use your truck for a minute here. Yeah, go for it. can't believe I got to drive a flipping traffic cone, though. Well, I'm just heading back from Ford here. Made a little stop and picked myself up. 2021 oh there goes colton ford f350 here anyway slightly used platinum here uh it's in really really good condition all pretty much highway miles on it so good to go the, the guys at ford did a cream job at loading this up yeah anyways the plan for this truck is to turn it into something a little bit like that one just not as high and uh we're gonna stick a camper on the back of it Ooh, can i fit it through the small door let's see here it is a crew cab long bed so this thing is like driving a limo who is even gonna fit on the lift yep just barely it takes up pretty much all of it there we go you know i told colton to move the mud truck the other day you know park it out front so there was uh, a bit of advertising for the business you know get some customers in this is not exactly what i had in mind it does look cool though, I will say, but it, it just pretty much looks like a big old squatted truck now. Also, we got the uh, the pulling truck out here. Uh, it's the official elevated AF pulling truck. We haven't had a chance to use it yet, but uh, I did have a buyer for it. And he's coming to pick it up today. So, unfortunately, he's leaving the shop. Just gonna toss the uh, the Ford Hilton should have used to tow that trailer today back in the showroom here. We had a customer here uh, come in, I think, a couple minutes ago. Uh, Colton's just bringing the truck around. He brought us a Toyota. Here it is. Holy smokes, that thing's loud. Yeah, just bring it up on the lift here. I'll, I'll bring it down here. Oh, a little bit to your right. Yeah, oh, too much, too much, too much. Oh, oh, oh. And straighten out. Yeah, just straighten out. Bring it on there. That's good. Anyways, customer brought us this. I think we're going to toss on a new lift for him, which we have... We have that in stock, right, Colton? Yep. Okay, perfect. And I think it's getting a new set of wheels and tires. Guys, let's start working on that along with the dually here. Oh, man, I forgot I had this thing. Colton, you ever driven this thing? No, I haven't. I'll take it for a little spin. All right. See, honestly, I would have rather you tow the uh, the trailer with the picnic table than with the Audi R8. Uh, I don't know if the picnic table would quite do it. It's got power. You'd be surprised. Hey, don't drive in the neighbor's field now. We talked about this. Dang it, where's that shock for that truck? It'd be somewhere around here. I swear we had it. Hey, Austin. I can't find anything around here. What? Austin. Yeah. What are you doing? Uh, just looking for the shock for the uh, 350. Oh, go come over here for a minute. Okay. This this got me a little bit worried here, not going to lie. I hear something. Where's this kid getting out? No flipping way. You got a mini truck. I traded my doom buggy for it. Dude, this thing's sick. I know. Oh, man. Dude, this is so cool. Oh. Hey, go grab the other mini truck. We got to go do something. What? what are, okay, what are, what are you doing? What do you have in just mind go here? Get, go, go get the other mini truck. Uh, okay, okay. This got me worried again. What is this kid planning now? You just want me to follow you or what? Yeah, follow me. Oh, my goodness. See, now you just got to pimp out your mini truck like mine. Got to get some rims and a lift for it. What in the heck? Colton, mind explaining what in the heck is going on here? You like? Oh, they're, they're cool. Are these, shop, are these shopping carts? Yeah. I pay you way too much money, man. 
way too much money. It's so ridiculous. Uh -uh. Do they go fast? They cruise. Okay, yeah, they got a little bit of get up and go to them. Oh, jeez, these things are these are drifty. Holy smokes. Oh, they, they swing. <laughs> what? Dude, this is ridiculous. Where did you even buy these things? Marketplace. Oh, man. <laughs> The crap you can find on Marketplace. It's amazing. The thing I'm even more surprised about is the fact that you managed to find two. Not just one, but two of these things. And oh, they always. drift like crazy. Kind of reminds me of those drifting crazy carts. But my question is, why did we specifically bring the mini trucks? Well, why do you think? I don't even think these will fit in the back, dude. I'm going to be honest. It might be a little tight. Yeah, dude, this is ridiculous. Hold up. I got an idea. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That didn't go to plan. Colton, Colton. Oh, you did. I tipped over. I need help. Look at it. It's reversed. It's you breaking stuff this time, not me. Yeah, for once. There we go. Back on four wheels. Oh, no. Oh. You're going to flip. <laughs> you flip. <laughs> oh, no. I flipped. No. All right. So it's been a couple days here. We've been uh, working nonstop. We almost got the dually finished, but... We did get the customer's Toyota finished, and holy smokes. Yeah, this thing, this thing's crazy, dude. Brand new big old lift. She's got some JTX forged wheels. Instantly turned it into a pavement princess, but hey, besides the point, it's pretty dang good. Colton, I think this is your type of vehicle, buddy. Uh, I think I could daily this one. Yeah? Yeah. Kind of reminds me of uh, a crew cab Ford Ranger, if there was such a thing. Yeah, I can see that. All right, well, the customer should be here any minute to go pick it up. So uh, let's take it for a quick drive around the block. Do not blow it up. Do not do anything crazy. Oh, around the block just to test it out, make sure it's good. Okay, so it's been a couple more days here, and Colton went to go pick up the camper for this new dually we just finished building. I haven't got a chance to see the new dually yet finished, but from what the guys in the shop were saying, it's pretty dang cool. Also, the guy unfortunately backed out of the uh, the pulling truck sale, so it's back up for sale. Or we might just say screw it and take it to a couple pulls, dude. Oh man, that turned out wicked. A couple trailer tires are off the ground, but. Besides that, it's good. What do you think? I love this thing. Dude, this turned out nuts. Full striker lift kit, some big old wide American forces, crap ton of rock lights. Holy smokes. I don't think we needed that many, but uh, I'll work with it. Hood stack. Uh, what else is full paint match and a brand new camper to match that. Okay, so we wanted two trucks. One with a boat, one with a camper. And I think these two go together pretty dang well. Now, we were going to go as tall as this truck with the, uh, the camper truck, but kind of thought about it. There was no way in heck we were going to be pulling a camper with anything this tall. Unless it was a uh, bumper pull. And with bumper pulls, you really don't get as much. So we decided to go with something a little more manageable, even though this thing is still way too tall for a camper we made it work now before this sells because we actually have offers on both these we may have to go out to the lake and uh do a little testing hey colton might have to a little bit of quality control real quick but either way these turned out crazy let me know what you guys think in the comments but i hope you all enjoyed subscribe and goodbye